Okay, so on to the second last track or uh, second last performance of Vicky, Vicky's Harmony series. There might be a bonus one. There might actually be a bonus one. This might be the third last. Um, you will know in time. But uh, yeah, this one up here is Greg Laswell, Not Out. Um, never heard of this artist either. Never heard of this song. This is completely brand new to the channel. There are gardeners cutting my lawn in front over here and... Uh, um, it's making a bit of noise, but the microphone should block that out a little bit. So um, hopefully that's not coming through too much. But uh, yeah, Greg Laswell, not out. Let's uh, see what we've got. This series has just been absolutely incredible. We are now at the very high point of this series, and it's coming to an end, which is very, very sad. But it's been absolutely beautiful. Anyway, Greg Laswell, not out. Let's see what we got. Not gonna fall down today. Instead, I will buckle my knees and sway against sweet memories, against memories. I've gotta get out of here. I love these fucking lyrics already. Absolutely fantastic. Firstly, the fact that it starts with, I'm not going to fall today, down today. That's a great mentality to have, right? You need to be telling yourself that every single fucking day, right up until your deathbed, right up until your last breath. That is the line that you tell yourself every fucking day right and then going into here i've got to get out of here today sure bad situation's cool there is there is too much room in this bed where i lay exactly 100 percent. your comfortability is what's holding you fucking down the things that you should be doing are the things that you fucking hate doing because that's how you armor plate your mind if you hate to run that's why you should fucking run if you hate to do certain things, that's why you should do them. Do the things you hate first and create a habit of doing the things you don't like first because it armor plates your mind. It armor plates your mind. It'll make the things that you do enjoy so much more enjoyable because the hard things don't, don't uh, um, 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 sort of push you down, essentially. You, 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 you make it a, a habitual thing. You create these neural pathways in your brain where you are now getting dopamine hits from, uh, um, or even serotonin hits from things that you don't like to do. And that rewires your brain. Come on. I've got to get out of here today. There is too much room in this bed where I lay The street buzzes for me The low buzzes for me And if the breeze blows me down I'll take my time to come around This, this this is literally my type of music this speaks to me i'm not out do never count me fucking out ever 
That is, the, that is the mentality that you should always have. It's momentum, 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 consistency. That is all it is. Then life is a fucking uphill battle and will be an uphill battle every fucking day. And if you think that you are owed, you are owed, um, uh, um, you're, you are owed the fact that your life should be easy. You are, you, are, you are owed fucking nothing. You want your life to be easy, then make it easy. You do it. It's your life. No one's coming to save you. No one's doing that. You need to do that for your damn self. And if you count yourself out from the beginning, you are 100% out. Right? So, never count yourself out. Every single day, never count yourself out. Ever count yourself out. You know what I mean? Every single day should be another fight. And that, and that, that, that fight should excite you. That fight should light something underneath you that every little fucking increment every everything that you do every time you fail better that should light a fire beneath you that's what makes life so beautiful right it's not the easy cheap things that you are able to attain it's the fucking difficult things of value the things that you are able to conquer and see the other side that is what is valuable. If somebody comes to you and say, take a look, look how I built this fucking shed, it took me three days, and take a look at this shed, it's still a fucking shed. But if someone comes to you and says, take a look, it took me 20 years and I built this cathedral, that's where the value is. Because you know where the pain, what, how long it took, the pain, the dedication, the hard work, the momentum, the never giving up, the hard conditions built something, it made, it gave it value. And you can see the value because it's intrinsically there. You can see it. It's beautiful. It towers over everything. It makes the shed look completely and utterly insignificant. Do not turn to mediocrity. Turn to absolute exceptionalism. And maybe you don't hit exceptionalism, but at least you get fucking close enough. And at least you can say that I climbed up that mountain. I climbed up that mountain as far as I fucking could. And I got so close to absolute exceptionalism. And guess what? That will be your exceptional. But if you settle for mediocrity, you're going to fucking get mediocrity. I'm not Joseph of his earlier work I'm actually it's, that's, I think that's what's uh, really sort of like connecting me to this Are you Absolutely beautiful song. Love, 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 love that piece of music. Like I said, this series has just been, and I did this series backwards for some odd reason. It's actually just because of the way I put it in my task manager. If I put the first one first, and then I put the second one, it starts pushing that one down the list. So actually, the last becomes the first, and that's how 
weird. But anyway, I'm always very cognizant of if anything does connect to each other, I'm cognizant to make sure that it gets reacted to in that way. But this one, they're all um, sort of like their own track, so it makes no difference. So, um, But for this one particularly, I'm quite happy that we did it the other way around. Love that piece of music. We're going on to the last one. There might be a bonus one coming. Um, you'll obviously know when it drops, but uh, let's call it the very last one that's coming now. And well, let's not call it anything because there might be a bonus one. So let's uh, let's just get on to the very next one. Love you all. Please stay safe. I'll catch you now. Peace.